that's them coming in and around your legs, whichever side you want, and going between your legs and standing. So the way I first start it, hopefully you can see, is I just start with my legs uh, together so that they can't go between, and I just teach them to go around. So basically treat them both hands, lure, lure them around, good boy. Okay. So we have a really beautiful around the other side, however long that takes. And then the next step I will do is I will just now trick them basically and uh, stand with my legs apart. So dog in front, going to now have my legs apart. Uh, most of them are just going to do the tight circle because they're used to your one leg, and so they're going to end up between, and you're going to treat. Yeah, good boy. Lots of cookies. Good boy. Super fantastic. Those cookies don't want to break very well. Good, free. Good boy. Ready? Lots of cookies for this position. Good dog. Good dog. Good boy. Okay, free. Oh. Good boy. Okay. So now this time, uh, now that he's doing it, he's doing it really well. I've done multiple sessions with him. Uh, he's got this. If I stand with my legs like so, and give him a little cue, he goes around and goes between my legs. So now I'm going to start naming it. Um, myself, I name it Peak. Uh, whatever he'd like to name it is completely fine. And so all I'm going to do is name it as he hits the position. Peak. Yeah. Super good. Good boy. Very good. At which point, once he's doing this really, really well, which he is, because he does know this trick already, um, when he's just in front of me, I will test him to see if he can figure it out. So I'm going to say his command. Um, I'm not going to give him his hand signal. And I'm going to see if he finds position. Ready? Peek. Yes. Good. Good man. 